Welcome back to the channel. I'm your host, Imperial Arm. This is No Man's Sky. When we last left off, we did a little B and E. We talked to a big monolith, told us to trust the Atlas. Uh, we don't really have a choice because, uh, well, that's gonna what, what's gonna guide us to the center of the galaxy. So let's go ahead and get started. I went ahead while we were uh, while we were in between episodes. I went ahead and uh, grabbed that ship, the one, the redeemable one. So we'll run over here, take a look at it real quick. It's very. Um, oh, it didn't grab it. Oh, I didn't save. Okay, you know what? You guys will get to see it, so we'll go ahead and do that real quick. We'll jump into the options menu here. Mm. Nope. Yes, we would like the Horizon Omega ship. Oh, compare. Okay. So we're basically we're going to transfer everything over because we're going to take the ship. It's better than ours right now. Plus, it looks way cooler. It looks like an X-wing. So, um, and for those of you guys who don't know, I just happen to be a huge Star Wars nerd. So uh, that's right up my alley. So all right. So we transferred everything over. Um, See, so it's got some better shields on it. And it's also got uh, some better, a little bit better weapons. So, but and there we go. All right, and as I said, it looks very uh, X-wingish. So, all right, so we've got to ascend to the stars. So we're gonna go before we do anything, so I don't forget again. We're gonna run over here and we're gonna save. Oh. All right, so there we go. We've uh, we've saved, and that uh, that should take care of us for now. So we could do another B and E here if we wanted to. We could blow open this. Uh, door. Well, we did get a new, we did get a new gun, so, or a new multi-tool, so let's take a look at all this stuff real quick. Alright, so there's a new multi-tool. Looks a lot like a, uh, a rifle from Destiny or Halo, so, um, cools down better, uh, better intensity. So, it's got the plasma launcher on it. Alright, it's Take care of her suit real quick here. Uh, or not our suit, our life support. Um, just the carbon that we got. All right, so all right. Let's go ahead and uh, hop in the ship here and blast off. Not enough fuel. <clears throat> I mean, it's not enough fuel. Uh, uh, okay. There we go. Uh, hyperdrive. So we do have the recipe for the, um, to make all the stuff now. So basically what we would do is we'd make these with suspension fluid. Then we'd make those, and then those turn into warp cells with Thanium-9. So, but we're not going to need it, so what we'll do is we're going to go ahead and... Nah, crap, wrong button. Mm. Go ahead and blast off. It's a rather nice nice place to be hit a scan and find anything close so there's where we were at previously Oop. there's something over there if we really want to go check it out let's uh yeah, let's go over there and check it out. So maybe we'll learn a language or something, or we'll learn words for a language. So, um, 
definitely hit me up in the uh, in the comments, guys. Let me know what you're thinking about the series so far. If you're digging it, you're hating it. Um, let me know um, your own adventures. You know, if you got a channel and you're doing No Man's Sky, by all means, leave it in the uh, leave a link in the in the comments, and I'll definitely get around to checking it out. Um, and if you're just if you're not doing any recording, you're just doing screenshots and stuff. You know, leave those too. We'll you know we'll definitely take a look at those. So, uh, yeah. Uh. Hmm. Oh, we can activate our. activate our uh, weapon underwater so uh, there's an underwater base I wonder if we can land out there I wonder if I would facilitate things any easier Weird uh, triceratops looking thing here. Another one of those worm looking things. I bet this thing will attack us as soon as we get close. Oh no, it won't. Hmm. Alright, did we already discover that one? No, we did not discover that one yet. Oh, I saw it's a mature one of what we already discovered, so... You know, we're not going to mess with the underwater base for, for now. Um... right next to a uh, broken down machinery and didn't even notice it. Oh, you none. <coughs> Alright. Let's get advanced cooling theta. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Alright. So an upgrade for our ship. Let's, uh... Let's actually take a look at this see what we can upgrade on our ship. So, if we were to come here, we were to want to install that or that. Oh, we've already. Oh, Theta and Tal. Uh, that one requires significantly more resources, so I wonder if it's better. I don't, uh, I don't know what the sequence goes. Oh, it's plus two, plus three. Yeah, we would definitely want that one. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and take off. All right. All right, we're gonna go head into the atmosphere. some crystals real quick. Or some asteroids, not crystals. Thallium. Alright, so I think we got enough of that. Let's go ahead and pull out to the Atlas map and figure out where we're going. There's an atlas interface over there. I 
Oh man. Deselect. We're gonna be able to make a jump to that. No. All right. So what would be? All right. So let's see if we can figure out the most logical route over there. If we don't lose it. Okay. Uh, why? Okay, so we can travel a bit further than what we were going to begin with, so... Alright, so we're scanning for discoveries. I don't know how that's actually going to work out for us, so... Four planets undiscovered. Let's go ahead and head there. It kind of looks like we're heading in the right direction as to where we're going, so if not, we'll just get lost and wander. We're on a space adventure, so eh, who cares? looking uh, space station looks like a uh, down boat from Reddit oh I did not mean to do that There's definitely a uh, Atlas Pass one. That's the way they've all been so far, so. Ooh. Yeah, that was dumb. Alright. Oh, we're happy to see you too, friend. Alright, so. And I've been neglecting on doing my uploads, so I'll have to do that while we're off camera at some point in time. Uh, or that, or if we really get desperate, we need credits, then that's what we'll do. Oh. Let's spin the chair. Sorry about that, guys. My dogs, uh, they like to bark at anything and everything, so... Um. Alright, so let's interact with the scholar, Entity Anichi. 
Corvax, something, something, something. Yeah. Uh, it's a startled the electronic life form from its work. It greets me politely, but when it sees my bolt caster, it starts to vibrate with fear. The entity's voice quavers. Its mask slowly turns to a single delicate red light. It clearly wants me to get back. To, it clearly wants to get back to its research work, but it is too terrified to take its gaze away from me. The more I try to calm it down, the more the poor thing convulses in fear. Insist I come in peace. The life form face suddenly wipes. It reboots with another. Uh, I lost standing. Request the new word. Uh, I learned a do word for please. Uh, okay, let's see what's going on at the Galactic Trade Terminal. Let's sell. No, no, no. What have we been using platinum for? I don't remember if we've used platinum for anything. It's powerful element, battle against technology blueprints. Okay. Uh, we might hold on to the platinum for now. That's mm. nah, just not worth it. Uh, from. Let's see what we sell from the ship. No, no. We could always farm out more iron if we needed it. Zinc sells pretty good, though. Alright, uh. Than we can make right now, so let's check the multi tool. Uh, we can install the beam focuser reload for the bolt caster. Uh, I think we're going to be doing some mining, so let's do yeah, let's do that, and that'll give us a that's a plus one to it. So, uh, one thing I did want to point out, guys. So, um, when you're when you're lining stuff up on your multi tool, you want to try to keep it all together. So, see how all three of or all four of these now have like a green highlight around them. They're now all amplified based off of the fact that they're next to each other. So, which is kind of nice. You can kind of work around like that. Uh, plenty of grenades so if we need to find if we find a hostile environment that's not uh, conducive to our f fragile bodies we can tunnel underground take care of that so oh man I want that thing right there that looks like firefly that looks like serenity oh. how much does one of these things cost oh, okay I don't care that I met the life forms Traveler. Uh, let's make an offer on the ship. 3.1. Oh, look at all that space. Oh my god. Yeah, we definitely want something like that. Uh, um, yeah, that, that's our goal. That's our end goal right now. Is that we get something like that. So, we will take our X-Wing and go work on our ambitions and our goals. To the planets. All right, so yeah, it's gonna keep telling me about those about those uploads. I will do the uploads. I promise. Check out that abandoned building. Ooh, rare technology available. We definitely want to go there then.
try to land as close to the thing as we can this time as opposed to having to hump it for miles so or kilometers or space units whatever Green distance is here so all right so sweltering average abundant moderate okay all right oh, it's not too bad Wait till the Celsius pulls up. So it's 69.7 Celsius. I have no idea how to convert Celsius. So, um, oh, oh, it's pretty freaking hot apparently. All right, so beam impact data. It's already known, and we flew all this way just to get burn up. Oh, <laughs> that's nice. Oh, okay. Yeah, we can do this all day long. Oh, man. Alright. Let's go down the hallway here, see if there's anything of interest or value. Oh, there's a sentinel chilling. Alright, so... Okay, so we've got decent protection from the uh, environment. Um, it's not, you know, just swarming down. Sentinels didn't see that. So I was watching another YouTuber's videos um, in between recording sessions um, before I was or during dinner. So um, I did see another another uh, YouTuber was he was actually attacking the Sentinels um, and he had a little upgraded weapon and whatnot. So but he was he was attacking the sentinels and they were dropping parts and blueprints and all the things so that may be something that we look at at the neck in one of the next videos or down the road somewhere is to start attacking sentinels just so that we can get better blueprints stuff like that so uh, all right so There we go, we're gonna come up to this thing pretty quick, so. Try to land on top of one of these things next time we come in. 75%. Aniki uh, Desert. There might be a cave over there worth exploring here in a second. Oh, this is another one of the suit upgrades. We definitely want to do this. So, uh, every time you find one of these, you want to do it. It'll basically it'll cost you. It'll go up every time, um, up to I believe 20 slots for your suit itself. So yeah, but we're definitely going to pay the the cash money for that one. So. Oh, 
Oh, there's a natural cave here. Let's see if it's... If we get any stabilization. New, uh, this new multi-tool is definitely better than the one we had before, so... Oh. I think we need a bypass chip for this one. No, we don't. Uh, nothing found. Okay. Yeah. Resource gather before we run off again. Probably have to refill our uh, our ship too. So and pop in, take a look at it. Eh, it's not too bad. We'll go ahead and fill it up anyway. There we go. Yeah, we need to work on that hyperdrive thing. So um, should fill us up. Well, almost. Okay, can we make anything? that place. Let's go check that place out. That looks like it has something good in it. Alright guys, so here we go. Back out on the ground again. So. Stamina recharge. We landed on the wrong side of the dang thing, so. Or. May not even be anything we can go in. Oh, wait, no, there's the door. I was wrong. Disregard anything I say, guys. Okay. Bit of a clipping issue if you can see the grass blowing there. Oh, well, not that big of a deal, though. Range boost, yes. Hmm. Uh, this is going to require an Atlas Pass, yep. Uh, we got to find us an Atlas Pass. That's going to require an Atlas Pass. What's this thing? Huh. We like free credits. We'll take those. Alright, so... Let's see one of those little things, though, that you can hit to save your location, so... There it is. All right, so we're going to run over there. We'll save. And then I think we're going to go ahead and put a break in here, guys. Um, 
I'm gonna do some off off camera resource farming and see if we can figure out where things are at, so see if we can get this warp drive thing fixed. Alright. Uh alright guys, so uh remember I'm uh Imperial Arm, this is uh, No Man's Sky. If you like the video, um, please hit the like button below. If you want to see more content, uh, especially No Man's Sky here on the channel, go ahead and subscribe, uh, share with your friends. And remember, guys, nothing follows.